Hey guys, in today's video I want to share with you guys my experience with iOS 12 Beta 4 so far. For whatever reason, there's just been so many bugs and glitches with this version of iOS 12. iOS 12 Beta 1, Beta 2, and Beta 3 have been phenomenal, and they did have bugs, but this one, Beta 4, just seems to be the worst one so far, unfortunately. So I want to talk about my experience with that. I also want to talk about when we can expect the next version of iOS 12, Beta 5, of course. So let's begin. Now the first thing I want to share with you guys is a screen capturing. So I set a timer and the timer expired but apparently the timer there on the uh, control center can keep spinning you see there no timer but it keeps spinning and it reacts like it's still a timer going so an interesting bug I click the pause several times and then it disappeared so I set a timer again and when the timer expired it continued to do the same thing the timer will expire but control center icon will continue to spin for whatever reason I'm not sure why that is I've also encountered some uh, weird ones on the lock screen as well this one's a little more popular or common because I've seen a lot of posts on Twitter for this one the time and date disappearing from the lock screen which is rather rather interesting so this one's also a bug within the lock screen for beta 4. I'm not sure how many of you guys have experienced this next bug but sending a message and receiving messages won't show on your message thread so you'll get the notifications you get the prompt but when you open message the message will not show now it doesn't happen all the time as you see here but I notice sometimes when the device is locked if you unlock it and you have a notification for the messages you go in there and you don't see any messages on your thread or they'll be out of order for whatever reason really weird so what I do is I quit the application several times and then I get my messages back now one of the most annoying bugs with iOS 12 beta 4 that I've experienced and I'm not sure how many of you guys have as well is when you put the brightness down completely and I have a standalone video on this one if you put the brightness down completely as you see here and I lock the device I can't get access to the device again even though if I try asking Siri to bring the brightness up or anything like that I have to click up down on volume and then hold power to reboot my device in order to try to bring the brightness back up it's very very annoying because at night I like to put the brightness down completely down and then I can't access my device when I go to tap to wake because of this bug is really really annoying especially on the iPhone 10 here's another interesting one submitted to me by one of my subscribers via email this one's rather interesting as well you see dictation constantly loading as trying to type a note the performance of the device is very slow and sluggish and you see there that it just keeps loading over and over again so now let's go ahead and talk about when we can expect iOS 12 beta 5 because I'm sure a lot of you guys as I am are expecting the next version hopefully to fix a lot of the issues and bugs even some that I didn't cover on this channel because I haven't encountered a lot of devices are different and a lot of people's experience are different and I'm sure you guys have encountered some bugs as well so when can we expect the next update to iOS 12 to hopefully fix these issues well if time in history is any indication we'll see it on Monday the 30th that's when we'll see iOS 12 beta 5 no later than the 31st but I'm pretty sure Monday the 30th is when we'll see the next version of iOS 12 iOS 12 beta 5 and that's everything I wanted to share with you guys I hope you guys enjoy the video and thank you for watching I'll see you on the next one peace